What's up, guys? You know who this is, so it needs no introduction. Thanks for watching my video. Hope that you guys are having a wonderful day. Um, I took down that other video, um, not because I'm scared or anything like that, and with the death threat. So I basically, I just want to give a nutshell for people who are just watching and saw the other videos and they're wondering where is this drama coming from. Um, basically, I got a couple of death threats. I found out certain people were liars and what other stuff happened. That's that's perfectly fine. I don't care who it is. Um, it's It doesn't matter to me. But I took it down because it's just, I don't want that kind of negativity on my channel. It just shows that everybody is human. Everybody has emotions. People can go overboard. I learned something from it. Something good, a couple of good things came out of it. So if those of you who are just coming in late and wondering, you know, what my other videos were about and what I was talking about, basically I was getting some death threats and some of the things that people were trying to talk to me about um, ended up being liars. I don't know who lied, who told the truth, nor do I really care. But um, I basically lashed back at the very people that are the cowards coming here. And you can see by the extra thumbs down. So, uh-oh, I don't know what I'm going to do. Thumbs down on a video. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it's just I don't want that negativity. I want to show people you can have love. and But it also shows you could turn um, a negative thing into something positive. So I said what I said. I got it out. I feel a hell of a lot better. I don't have to worry about any more stories that are happening. I'm letting the police handle it. Uh, the person who made the death threats was dumb enough to leave their phone number. I know who the person is. Um, is um, I'm not even going to mention their name, so don't worry. I'm not going to show any phone numbers. But um, I'm just going to let the police handle it if it continues. And I have family that's police. So, you know, it's you take care of it the right way. Things get done. So, um, yeah, the funny thing is, earlier this week, I was actually pretty bored. So I guess it's like the true thing. Be careful what you wish for. You might get it. So um, to the girl dory that got caught in the middle i don't know why they contacted me the way they did on telling me all these things but somehow um your one friend and you know who i'm talking about uh seems to be thinking i seem to be the problem when they contacted me i don't understand that but you know whatever he can think whatever he wants you could think anything you want um he told me that you wanted to think about committing suicide from this and i really hope you don't do that i hope that is not true but it just shows how desperately sad some men out there are that you made a girl cry to the point where she wanted to commit suicide because she thought she was something she ended up not being. And I was the one man enough and honest enough to tell her the truth when I found out the lie. I think that's a sad little man that can do that. But um, anyway, I don't have a problem with anybody, even the haters. You know, they keep ten sending me learning lessons. So thank you for the experience. You let me know that the old way, because people that have gone to my channel know that I was pretty much for the longest time, even until semi-recently, I've been almost like a kind of a drama queen where I would get very defensive. I would write back some stupid childish replies. I'd get angry and stuff. And I never really, I guess, accepted it or wanted to realize it, even though people that I um, consider friends pointed that out for a long time. And this week, with all the things, despite what happened, I just, I literally became happier. And then all of a sudden, you could see the comment replies I had for people were just so much better. Like, I had people calling me Satan worshippers and all this other stuff. And I'm like, well, if that's what you want to think, you know, just have fun doing it. If it helps you in your life, then, you know, good luck with that. Instead of, oh, you're an idiot and I'm going to block you and this, that, and the other thing. So something good came out of this. So I'm happy about that. And I hope that teaches other people as well. But I, I just want to let everybody know the reason why I deleted that, that video. But I honestly don't care about the negative people who contribute nothing to the society. Because they're a dime a dozen. And I hope there are people that come to my channel. And there's a select few. Because let's, let's keep it real. I have over 8,000 subscribers. My average video view is about these days about 400. So that's about 5% of my subscribers actually watch my videos. Then you take in the people that come here because they hate me and the trolls. That probably brings it down to about 3%. So like I says, in the, on the title of my front page, it says helping you unite the people one person at a time. So I don't care if I have thousands of people. If I have one genuine person, I'll take one genuine person over 5 million fake people any day. So if I make one person happy, then I'm still doing better than the people that are trying to hurt millions. 
Because I'll guarantee you this, you hurt a million people and they know who you are, they'll hate you forever. I only help one person and they know why I did it and it was sincere, they'll love me forever. I'll take the one over the million any day. So we'll all learn from this. I'll learn from this. I'm going to keep going strong, and I'm sure this will not be the last I've heard of this. There'll be more people that want to start drama. Other people think it's fun to hurt people or try to hurt people, and I'll just take the best out of it and say, no, thank you. This is my amusement park. So that hasn't changed. The people who sent me the information may have changed, but the events themselves and how they affected me in a positive way it's not going to go away. So I'm going to keep, I'm going to make a better copper band. I'm going to keep looking into that. And yeah, somebody told me, he's like, oh yeah, you can go on the internet. That stuff's been around for years. Well, I didn't know about it. So I learned about it. And I know I could see by the, some of the comments on that video that some of my subscribers didn't know about it. Now they know about it. So something good came out of it. That's what you got to do. You always got to look for the good in things. So, I, again, I took the video off. I don't want the drama. I don't want that hate. And I don't want that. And it's just, that's the way it is. It's my channel. This is my house. I'll do whatever I want. And if you want to hate me because my opinion differs from yours, then you have anger issues and mental problems, and you should really seek therapy. And the funny thing is, I used to get upset when they called me crazy. But yet, I'm just talking about things because I'm not afraid to talk about them. Yeah, aliens might sound weird. Having um, the United States being a corporation sounds crazy. The fact that we still have maritime law, that really sounds interesting. But that doesn't mean it's not true, or it can't be true, or even if it's not true. Even if, I, even if every single thing I've ever talked about was absolutely 100% made up. So what? I didn't put a gun to anybody's head. I've said in almost every video, I'm not here to tell you how to think. I'm here to show you alternatives that the media and the governments will never share with you. You do with it what you will. And if people are going to hate me for wanting to do that, God bless them, man. That's some really, that takes a lot of balls. I'll give you credit. But it also shows that they're afraid to show themselves. There's a reason for that. That's why I put my face out there. So anyway, I've, I've said the same thing over and over again. You can't really say much more than this. I'm doing this basically for me. Because when I talk about it, it makes me feel better. I move on, and I'll just wait for the next drama that comes my way and see what I can learn from it. So, you know, if somebody hands you a coal, squeeze the, sh the well, I almost said something bad, squeeze the you-know-what out of it and make it into a diamond. Then turn around and sell it to the very person who tried to fool you with the coal. Thanks for watching, guys. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'm going to go relax. Peace.